What's good YouTube? My name is Ash. Thanks for tuning in. Today I'm going to be filming a try on haul from Fashion Nova. I'm not partnered with them or anything. I just buy their clothes sometimes and then whenever I get clothes I do try on hauls. So I just filmed like myself trying on two different outfits and I wasn't filming the last bit of section. So I'm just going to do it all over again. This is the first and second bit of clothing. <laughs> Um, these are Fashion Nova men's, they're size medium. Normally I get a large size in pants, but they were out and I'm actually glad that I got these in mediums because they, they feel like a large. And then this is a bodysuit. Follow me on Instagram, I'm gonna take a picture in this outfit. This is like how I dress uh, for the most part. And I actually got something different in my life. <gasps> bras, I never wear bras guys. I got two bras from Fashion Nova. This one and this one is, it, I mean, it, they're the same bra, but that, this one's nude and this one's black. Because if you wear this kind of shirt, you can't not wear a bra, like it looks really weird and it's a light color. So I said all this <laughs> when I wasn't recording, but basically these bras, they're the same size. I'm 34B, I know what bra size I am. Um, 10 out of 10 for the bras, 10 out of 10 for this bodysuit, 10 out of 10 for the Pants. I have this thing called OnlyFans where you could subscribe and see me uh, essentially uncensored try on haul. Basically, go from this outfit to the next. Don't think it's anything like super like, oh, you guys want to watch me change that? Like, it's not like that. It's not like that. I'd be like, okay. Like, it's, you know what I mean? But I mean, shit, it's there if you want. So, down below in my description, if you want to sub to my OnlyFans to see uncensored try on hauls, I don't doubt someone's probably gonna take it and post it on YouTube or something. So, or you can watch it on whoever's channel who posts it. But let me go ahead and move on to the next outfit. Ta -da! So this is a, a sleeping thingy, man. This this fit the model so much cooler than it fit me. Like, I mean, her torso is like really skinny, so. It's, it's gonna show your body exactly how it is. How's that? It's very soft, so I give it a 10 out of 10 for that. I'm still gonna wear it. I was gonna give it away until I put it on, and it's so soft. I am very passionate about comfort, so I don't like how it looks, but it's so soft, it's still a 10 out of 10. And it's just because my body isn't perfect. But anyways, let me go ahead and try it on. The other thing, this is the last thing I filmed, or thought I filmed in a weird way that I wasn't even filming, so one second. So this is the outfit and it comes with a little hat, a Santa hat. Oh my goodness. And it sticks up for like high, that's kind of cute. So it goes pretty high, like literally like, I think, oh I did get this in the lingerie section, I forgot, but whatever. So this is how it looks, it goes, you know, pretty high up. I give this a 10 out of 10 because it's clearly holiday festive, you know what I mean? Like you can't take that for, like there's no mistaking that this is supposed to be for Christmas. So that was the intention behind it. So I give it a 10 out of 10. I wanna pause the video right now and take my thumbnail because I might might just post this as my thumbnail. Hold on. <laughs> this is what I'm gonna wear for Christmas. And it comes with buttons, I guess, but you really can't close it. So it's just like for aesthetic purposes, I guess. And I'm gonna wear this with a turtleneck with some high boots instead of a dress, obviously going to Nayeli's house. So I give this a 10 out of 10 because I'm feeling really like spunky and festive. Like, hey guys, Merry Christmas. Like I totally have to give everyone a hug wearing this. You know what I mean? So 10 out of 10, I really love this one. Let me go ahead and turn on this sparkly shit. Oh, this is for Nayeli's birthday. Ah! I'm so excited, she's turning 27. For all those who don't know, Nayeli is way younger than me. Yeah, let me try this one on. One second. Okay, I'm gonna wear this for New Year's too. I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna take a picture for Nayeli's birthday and New Year's wearing it like same dress, bitch. What's up? It was made for me. Oh shit, I wonder how I'm gonna do my hair. Cause it's not like, my hair's gonna be like this for her birthday. Her birthday is October, October. December 28th, so. I wonder how my hair will be around Christmas, December. Stay tuned. But yeah, obviously, like, yay, 
life is to be perfect. Somehow, some way, it's making my stomach look smaller than it is, and I'm just feeling it. So let me maintain or get better until. But yeah, let me go ahead and try my third thing. This honey thing is possible, chef. This is why I dress like this. Whoa, this would be a large. Okay, well, clearly. Well, that's kind of big. I should have got a medium. <laughs> so the heady thing is possible. Look at this, how the large is. It goes all the way to my knees. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Honestly, I'm probably going to cut it like... I'm probably gonna cut it somewhere because that's really baggy or wear it with some like pants and then have it like that. You know what I mean? Some baggy pants, obviously. Um, oh, I know what I can try on. This skirt. So I got this other uh, skirt. So this is how the skirt fits me. Well, I guess it, it looks cute. I don't know what I would wear. Oh, I guess a turtleneck. I'd wear it with a turtleneck, so makes me it, it's a bit tight but i think it's supposed to fit like this i don't really know i don't really wear skirts but i was trying to incorporate it into my wardrobe because on pinterest i seen a bunch i seen a bunch of winter style outfits that um had a lot of plaid i'm like i don't know plaid so let me also show you this with my head and it's supposed to be set oh my gosh YouTube. So I got two lingeries. I don't feel like putting it on. I got another um, thingy like this. I just put them on right now. They're like, I'll show you the side. And then it goes up to right here and it's like really cute. But I don't feel like doing this anymore. I'm like so tapped out from trying on clothes. So make sure to let me know what you guys think. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Once again, if you want to see the uncensored video, don't think it's very like, like, type shit, cause it's not, like it's really not. It was more so just me complaining about how difficult this was. <laughs> cause it's my first time doing it. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you turn on my notifications and I will see you guys on my next video. I love you so, 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 so much. Back to my YouTube channel. Welcome if you're new. Hello, hi, I'm Katie and then welcome back if you're a channel subscriber. You are the best. If you are new to my channel, this is a review. I normally do reviews on Mondays, but today we're having it on a Wednesday for a change because why not? Um, and I also do fashion hauls on Sunday, so definitely a reason to hit that subscribe for some good vibes. So today I'm bringing you a cup sheet video. So basically I'm going to be giving you my honest review of the swimwear brand. If I'm squinting also, I do apologise. As you can see, I'm in my garden. It's a little bit sunny today, which is lovely. Nice little treat. And I just wanted to film somewhere different for a change. So if there is any background noise as well, I do apologise. I have a discount code for you guys as well. I'll leave it here on the screen now. So if you do enjoy and want anything from the video, obviously you can use this code and anything on the website. But it has to be for a value of £70, I think. Or $70, I'm not too sure. Um, so these have been kindly sponsored and gifted from Cupshe. So they haven't actually paid me to do this review. It will be my honest review of the bikinis and swim suits but um yeah they have been gifted very kindly and i'm very grateful because they're actually very beautiful so i'm really excited to share them with you so let's get straight into it so my first and maybe my favorite is um this one and just for size reference i'm a uk size 12 so um i actually think i got everything in a size medium which when the lady i was chatting to who organized these all for me um sorted them out she when she said medium I was thinking are you sure because I'm normally a large when it comes to these things um but actually the fit on them all is lovely personally for me I do prefer swimwear to be a little on the bigger side than the tighter side because I do feel like it digs in you know if you're gonna get like those tie strap bottoms you'll be fine but with things like this I have 10 I'm normally a size like 12 to 14 on the bum so these like are a little snug but they are they do fit me perfectly really they're just for my personal taste I would have preferred them a tiny touch bigger. Um, but they're really, really gorgeous. They've got this like little cinch in on the bottom. It's a really nice, like soft, pinky, nudie colour, something I'm very into. I absolutely love natural, neutral tones. Um, 
and the top is really different actually when i got out of the bag i thought oh my god i'm just gonna go with my boobies but actually it's fine um and it was really really nice on it's really really nice thick quality it did come with cups in but i've taken them out because i always feel like you can just see them so you know free free the boobs and then the back, you'll have to have a look at the back in the cutaway because I really can't describe how the back works. But it's like lovely crisscross and then ties up the bottom. I think it's really, really different because personally I prefer simple plainer bikinis, which you'll see in this. I like them because they're a bit more classic. I don't tend to get too bored of them. Um, and I just think they're just easy. And yeah, I personally just prefer a plain style bikini like this. Um, so most of them are quite plain that I'm going to share with you today. But I just think the fact that it's got all this detail on the bum and then at the back just gives it like that's something else, which is really, really nice. And also they've got like this like cut out each side bit, which is just again a bit different, which I've not seen before on a bikini. And I've worn many a bikini in my time. I forgot to also say they come in these really gorgeous bags that you could probably like take them abroad and keep use this as like a bikini bag. I'm not even going to lie because it's that pretty and cute. <laughs> this next piece is a really gorgeous swimsuit. So it's all in one and it does come with this option to have the frill around the waist but you probably know as much as I love frills so it might actually surprise you guys because I am a bit of a frill lover but this was just too much for me. This is so elegant and plain and simple, it's absolutely gorgeous, it's so flattering on, again this is a medium, the quality of the material is amazing, like really really good quality, especially when you're getting white, I always feel like it has to be double lined otherwise you just know it's going to go see through but this is I'm really really happily surprised with quality. I think this print is absolutely stunning. It looks a little bit like Ted Baker-esque. Um, so yeah, I'm really really happy with this. It's got a halter neck top um, and then a low back at the bottom, which is really lovely. And then it has, like I said, got this option. And it did look great on the model online. And it goes around the waist and then just ties and then you can tie it up to like a nice bow at the back. This speed car going fast. But this for me is personally not my style. I absolutely much preferred it with just the swimsuit on its own like this. I just think it's really classic, really elegant. It was obviously very flattering if you are, are conscious of your belly, not that you should ever be, and you should just embrace the body you've got. Um, yeah, so I really like this, but yeah, personally it's just not, not with the frill. And then the next bikini I've got to share with you, I'm sure this isn't the actual one I picked on the website, but it is very similar. Um, this is like a gorgeous little white and yellow stripy bikini and it's obviously got this like tie bit on the bust area again very flattering I felt like these bikinis are very flattering they've obviously thought about like women's shapes and what would suit a women's shape and I just think they're really really lovely and there's all like little bits of detail going on so again I love the back of this one it's got this like scoop bit at the back and then a crisscross um, and then obviously you could just tie it in here just to cinch the boobies up and in a little bit which is nice and then also we've got these bikini bottoms and these these are very flattering as well because they're not fully high-waisted the thing I the one I actually thought I ordered was fully high-waisted but these are sort of a little bit high-waisted which I think actually for like tanning would be a little bit better um so yeah I really like these and again the quality is really really great and I'm very impressed with the quality of these also the thing I like is they've got these bits that you can just like snip them off so you don't need to have it those tags poking out everywhere and things like that they're quite a high cut on the body and I think that can be quite flattering helps to give like an hourglass figure so yeah really really pretty and another nice bikini and then finally I have another bather for you so I really wasn't someone who wore bathers before I've always been more of like a bikini kind of girl but recently I just feel like I don't know sometimes you just don't feel like you want to get in a bikini and that's okay if it's okay to not feel that confident in the bikini you know some days you feel great and some days you just think I just don't want to get it all out today so for those days I think it's nice to have a little bather and this is probably the most flattering bather I've ever worn it's got like this sort of ruchy bit around the tummy and I always feel like if anything has ruching around this area it's so good for like hiding bloating hiding you know just anything maybe eating too many top the digestives which I am very guilty of um but it just basically flattens and smooths this area rather than uh, bringing attention to tummy area so yeah really really nice bikini again it's kind of like a nice high rise very flattering on the bum area and again it's got this gorgeous back I love this khaki green I just I just think khaki has been one of my favorite colors by ever and then obviously it's got this really pretty like tie up drawstringy back again the fit on this again was perfect really really nice obviously i love the frill sleeves on this just felt really girly and really feminine and i even think this would be nice like 
with just like a skirt on or maybe something like that and you could feel comfortable walking around in it like say we're gonna go on holiday this year it'd be really nice for that as well it's just got this really cute frill and yeah it's just really pretty and like ladylike and elegant and lovely and again it's like not ever gonna go out of style it's very classy and feminine and classic which is kind of the look i always try and go for so that is all of today's swimwear pieces to share with you i hope that you found this review helpful and useful and if you did please remember to hit that subscribe for some good vibes and i'll hopefully see you in the next video as i said i upload videos monday wednesday and sunday if you did enjoy this little edit from my garden then please give this video a thumbs up now and like i said i'll leave the discount code here and also down below this video if you aren't also following me over on instagram i would love to hear from you guys over there as well i'm at love and two underscores i also just wanted to share with you briefly that i'm doing a giveaway and i will leave it here on this page right now and you can head to my instagram and enter the giveaway to enter you must be subscribed and also follow me over on instagram and leave me a comment so i know that you have entered as well and you will have the opportunity to win this really gorgeous store summary bag i also have a zara haul coming up a h&m haul coming up and also a new in from lorna lux in the style collaboration so i'm really really excited to share those videos with you and make sure you are subscribed not to miss out on those so thank you all for being here today i hope you did enjoy this outdoor video with me and i will hopefully see you in the next one bye for now my channel so in today's video I have a bikini try-on haul in collaboration with Lego Life so thank you so much to Lego Life for collaborating with me and these bikinis are so stunning if you're interested I do have a discount code I did have to give you guys a plug if you're interested so I have a code for 20% off it's code Angela and I'll leave everything linked down below and let's just jump right into everything all right everyone so today's quote of the day is always be the hardest working person in the room so this first bikini is actually what I wore for the 4th of July and I added a little red bandana in my hair. Super cute. I got a fun picture of that. If you guys want to follow me on my Instagram, it's Angela Stein 3 You can check it out. But I really loved this bikini. No, I, I wasn't even thinking about it for 4th of July, but I love the colors red and blue together and then it just so happened to be 4th of July. So it was the perfect bikini and I adore it. It has a lot of extra details and that's where LIGO Life really stands out. It has these little red tassels, a little gold metal detail in the middle right here. So I just really adore this bikini and then the back is really cheeky as you can see right here. So I love it and it's high-waisted as well so just a really stunning bikini i got a lot of compliments when i wore this for the fourth of july and definitely check out their website they just have a lot of cute options that not a lot of other brands have like i haven't seen this print and then i wanted to show you guys that in the front it has a little ruffle so be sure to use my discount code if you are interested i'll leave it all linked down below so i love this little ruffle and then I'm going to just cut away to a fun little montage of me wearing this. print and I don't know why I have a thing for tropical prints my grandmother and grandparents lived in Hawaii so I just was immediately drawn to this bikini how stunning is this so the bottoms are very high-waisted as you can see and then in the back it's cheeky so I'll show you guys this and then after I talk about it I'll do like a little try on montage with some fun music overlaid so I'll show you that after but in the front they it has some beading right here so this brand definitely stood out to me in comparison to other bikini brands that are more mainstream because this brand had 
some bling on both of the bikinis that I'm going to show you. So nowadays I feel like that's a rarity unfortunately so I really love that they had this bling. And yeah, just like a matching bathing suit, a triangle top. I absolutely love the bottoms. They are snug, but the good part about it is that you can really pull them up high. Line this creep while you and me repeat This bittersweet heat is suffocating I'm waiting and always hesitating Kryptonite desires set my heart afire Heart on fire Set my heart afire they sent me and I really love them. I hope that you guys loved this bikini try on haul and keep an eye out because since it's summertime now I'm going to be posting a bunch of bikini try on hauls. Also I've gotten so much growth on my channel recently so I really appreciate all of the new faces and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. That would seriously mean so much to me and I will see you guys on Wednesday. Bye guys.